I am pleased to introduce this year's alumni speaker. Daniel Borka is a Bellarmine graduate from the class of 2004. He graduated from UC San Diego before receiving his law degree from UCLA in 2014. He now works as a deputy district attorney for Santa Clara County. I want to welcome you all to the 66th annual Mother's Guild Fashion Show. And I stand here before you as a proud alumnus, excited to speak to you all this evening. I've been hearing a lot of social and political rhetoric about divisions and the clashing of worlds. I'm from a different world. I'm actually from East San Jose, where I went to Clyde Fisher Middle School, the same middle school that my mom went to as a kid. And when I was going to school there, I lived in the same home that my mom did. When, at 16, she got pregnant, eventually dropping out of high school so that she can raise her three kids as a single parent mom. So you can imagine her surprise when I was telling her about this great school that I wanted to go to. And she asked, what's a Bellarmine? To her credit, while only eight miles away, Bellarmine might as well have been separated by a mountain and a sea. No one in my family had ever heard of it. No one in my family even knew where it was. It was quite literally a different world. But despite my interest in this school for its academic excellence, a lack of opportunity very nearly kept me from climbing that mountain and crossing that sea. Because, and this is where current parents should cry, the then 10,000 a year tuition is something that my family just couldn't afford. And so I did well on the entrance exam, but that was it. That was supposed to be the end of my story. My family couldn't afford to send me here. And I just wish you all could have been there to see my mom as she got overwhelmed with joy by receiving a phone call from Father Mathewson who told her that they would be extending a full ride scholarship so that her firstborn son could come to this school. I was raised by a beautiful mother and a supportive family. I was raised by this Bellarmine community. And so when St. Ignatius asked of our Lord, teach me to serve as I should, to give without counting the cost, I stand here to extend my sincerest gratitude for those of you who have given to me and so many others of us in need without ever counting the need, counting the cost of your generosity.